Yo, what's up, New York City and the rest of the world? It's the undeniable JT Money from the Almighty Poison Clan. And this is all hip hop. Dot com. In case you ain't know, you will know after you watch this episode. Let's go. Shit. What's good, y'all? I go by the name of DJ Thorough. My name is Chuck Creek, my a.k.a. Jigsaw. Exactly. And listen, let me do this properly, man. We got a motherfucking legend in the building, a Miami legend, a day kind of legend in the building. He responsible for hits like Spore Rotten. Hey. Bad Influence. Hey. Check what your mama gave you. Hey. The bitch that I hate. Hey. In my nature. Hey. And one of my favorite, I hate hoes. Hose Don't hate judge me. I Don't judge me. Hoes, hoes, hoes hate me. I hate hoes. Hoes hate hoes. me. We got JT Mud. Oh, excuse me. And and most most importantly, one of his biggest hits. Who that? 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 Ay, ay, ay. You know what it is, man. We got JT Money in the building. Yeah. yeah. What's up, what's world? Up? New York City. Exactly. Hey, what's the world? What's happening? What's up? Yeah. yeah. Listen. It's all hip hop right here. You did. Yes. Yeah, so For just so you, you, see, you see, I'm naming the titles. Wait a minute, hold on. He just gonna flash the kick, flash the, 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 the right? kicks. What we got there? What's those? I don't know. Prototype, man. Something new. They coming out next month. Next, next month? Week. Yeah. Okay. Y'all have y'all's next week. Next All right, week. Work, All right. Work. The rest of them get them. That's what's All right. up. As we as we as we should. Yo, listen, man. It's, it's what they're doing in, in Europe. That's what they're doing. <laughs> That's what I'm talking All right. About. Listen, man. It's a pleasure and an honor to have you on this. Thank show. you, brother. You know I've been a fan a long time. Just you know, from I know I know all your shit. Yeah, you know, boy. Poison Clan. Poison Clan. You know what I mean? Like, in my opinion, man, the two, the album Too Low, too low Life Motherfuckers. Yeah. You know what I mean? That was, that's the classic, that's man. That's classic, yeah. Like, a lot of people don't give you credit. You are the first, in my opinion. I could be wrong, and you can fact check You're me on this. You're not wrong. I'm not wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not wrong. Listen. Ask, ask your uncles and your for, big for, for some street shit in Florida, you were yeah. the first one talking that street shit. True story. That's a true story. Before, yeah. it was what we, we called back then booty shake. Booty music. shake, really? It was right. booty shake. Right. You came with street shit. You know what I mean? Right. Why, why did you go that direction when at that time it was nothing but dance music? I mean, that's all I was really uh, listening to. Like, me, myself, I was a fan of rap music, the lyrics, and then I, I would compare the songs I liked to what I was seeing. It's like, nah, that's mm -hmm. not, you know, like, I like this. But what I did was I did this on a fast beat. Right. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And that, mm -hmm. then that created another genre because it's like, whoa, I, but I could still groove, but he's speaking the language. Right, and right. And, uh, doing what felt good. That's what felt good to me. So it wasn't no intent. It ain't like I sat out. I was just doing me. Right. Who, who, were you, who were you listening to at that time? Um. Well, during that era, like, the Poison Clan, like, you know, we was, we was just fans of music. So we, we was just, like me, all right, my personal favorites, right? You ready yeah, for this? Yeah, yeah. See, I'm a, I'm a cool J Rock, him, Big Daddy Kane, Ice Cube, Scarface mm. type of dude. Mm. And I love me some Chuck D, you know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But then I came up, you know, and I was hearing all the music, you know, EPMT and uh, right. Bucktown them and all that. You know, right. I'm, I'm about that. I was about that. It was about that. You know, Definitely. so that's the stuff we was doing. Yeah. We right. was doing that music. Right. right. Yeah, and you and you also like because at, at that time, because you can attest to this. At that time, New York and down south wasn't clicking in terms yeah. of in terms of acceptance. Yeah, right. you know what I mean, so right. it, it was it was a stereotype that people from south couldn't rap. Right. They put that shit to the to, to they laid that shit to Man, rest. That like, was intentional. Yeah, right. Yeah, that was on purpose. That was on yeah. purpose, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So, yeah. so now clear something up for me, Devin Devonair. He, was he from New York? East New York, he, Brooklyn. Right. Okay, he's from oh, Brooklyn. Okay. Right. <laughs> way to come see me now. You know, yeah. right. my brothers doing my new. Right. Bad right. ball Uzi. He said he's on the way here. Right. Yeah. Well, he coming down here to meet me. He oh, that's what's up, man. We gotta get him up here. But look, um, I tell people about that Tulo Light Mother album. I said it was a California DJ. A Mr. New York cat and a Miami cat. Right. We put that project together. Man, that's the classic, Miami man. Yes. And I'm glad you brought yeah. up the producer, Mr. Mix. Mr. He Mix. don't get enough credit for yeah. producing. He produced he that made whole that sound. Yeah, that sound, mm -hmm. like that was that yeah. whole sound, like Two Live yeah. Crew. Yeah. That was Mr. Produced Mix every, doing right, all of that. And I, in my opinion, he don't get enough credit for that, yeah. man. You know what I mean? Like he he laced y'all. Like that's yeah. a hands down. That's a classic record, man. Yes, sir. And you gave birth to this term called flodging. Yeah, right. Flodging, we, right. They call it capping now. Okay. Yeah, it's capping now. It's right. capping now. Boy, you know, boy, now it's tough now. I'm telling <laughs> you. But they're flodging. Yeah. I'm a flodging the fact that you're faking. Right, that's your favorite, right. Yeah, right? you know. He said flodging, the paint was in the shop and needed a glaze. Yeah, it's yeah, been in the shop for a couple, couple of days. days. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. It's crazy. Yeah. And Spore Rotten, when you said you got a, um, I don't know if you oh, said it, or Debonair got a dog with a mouth full of gold. Yo, they were saying some shit yeah. in the album, man. I suggest anybody go yeah, back and listen to it. Right you owe this man a check. You from from Florida, and you talking street shit. You owe him a check. 
Yeah, you know I mean, huh? definitely. Check. 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 <laughs> now you Work. working on? We we gonna get back into the history definitely, right. but I wanted to make sure we talk about your new music too, because like, yes. you know, you're working on a project. First of all, talk yeah. about the single with. The, the, the Mount Rushmore. Yeah. I, I, instead of just doing my, I call it Miami Mount Rushmore because it's like myself, Rick Ross, and Trick Daddy. Yeah. You know, that's something to say. They just want, they've been trying to get us on the record right. forever. Mm -hmm. Y'all yeah. do an album, do a mixtape. Well, I finally got us to do a single. Hopefully, okay. we're going to be able to okay. do something else because if our schedule is allowed, uh -huh. or, just, or just make enough money. Right, right, right. Now, hold That's on. Right. One person is missing from that, in my opinion. Uh -oh. yeah. where's, where's Luke? Luke, uh -oh. Luke got to be on there. Yeah, well, Luke, Luke going to show up in the video. Okay. I, I said it again <laughs> first. I don't know if it was too slow. I'd say all I need you to do is just talk that talk. Talk this shit, right? right? Hey. Luke, and then introduce me. I'm going to take off. Then Trick going to go. Then Ross going to go. And, you know, but uh, I got a surprise do for the video, though. Okay. Well, we just wrapped it up yesterday. But I got all of them, you know, all the... Uh, Luke Callett and Oh, you uh, finished the video. Yeah, we just uh, well, I finished filming. Finished so now filming. Gotta editing. Be, yeah, we gotta do all that, but it's coming soon. Well, what's the video like? Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get away as a surprise. Uh, man. Come on. We always awesome. looking for this. We <laughs> always that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Ain't nobody heard awesome yet. It's gonna be awesome. Okay. Nah, okay. but I, I you know, I gave you the um, you know, the faces that's gonna be in uh, like I'm I'm gonna really wake the city up. I, I, every so often you gotta Get back, you know, mm. throw something in the game so the game can have something else. Right, right. You yeah. know, yeah. I always said that, um, and and obviously you have a record together. When I bring this name up, Too Short, Damn. you're like the you're like the I would say my you represented by Too Short is the Oakland. Yeah, that's mm. what he is in Miami. Yeah. And in fact, y'all had a record, yeah. the, the pimping yeah. on what you was on a pimping on wax, something about pimping yeah, or whatever. You always been talking right. that type of rhetoric on records, right? Like, the fact, like yeah. always. Yeah, yeah since the beginning, right? So it was just, uh, again, doing me, man. I was just doing me, speaking my language, and not let those with ears hear. Right. What was your life like back then? I don't know. I I, I think I'm awesome in real life, man. I don't know. Like, <laughs> listen, I don't, I, I, we, I, we go through stuff. We yeah. deal with things. We live life, life is going to life, but I always find a way. I always handle it. I don't, I, ain't no problems, you know, that. You know, I, I never tuck my tail and lay down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I, I don't know, something like that. I know you asked me what my life was like. Right. My life was good, man. It I had was a good, good mama. I, mean... I had a good mama, man. My mama yeah. was good, man. <laughs> right. Stepdaddy, you know what I'm saying, made a man out of me, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. R.I.P. Gator, you know, that's my nigga, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Forgive me, y'all. We, yeah. we had a young rapper in here on... Um, uh, Major Nine. He's Major Nine. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's my dude. He, talk, too. he talked about the influences of of Miami um, when he was growing up. You yeah. you were mentioned in that, and a lot of other people too. He mentioned right. a lot of people that I never even heard of. You right, know what I'm saying? right. Um, can you talk about how you managed to break through? Like, how did you, did, like, cause, like he said back then, it wasn't likely to hear somebody coming out of the South right. representing that way. But to do it is kind of like courageous, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, well, again, um, all right, good music is good music, right? A right. hit is a hit is a hit. Like, mm -hmm. you either love it or you hate it. It can't stop a hit. Okay. At the time, Luke Records was like the major independent. You right. know, Two Live Crew was like the biggest thing going. Yeah. So we were just blessed to put out like what they call platforms today we just went through their pipeline mm, okay. you know, but we right. had something good to go through the pipeline right straight to the bloodstream right. <laughs> right, right, right. right so y'all met luke if i'm not mistaken at the talent show you and you and Devin we met mr mix oh mr mix at a talent show so how does that how, how did y'all get discovered so to speak how did how did that happen man Big Daddy's 8600, college night. We too young to be in there, but we in there, and we were getting that gong show. It was a gong <laughs> oh, show. Wow. Gong, the gong show. Yeah, gong, the gong, gong show. Wow, wow. They, wow. Uh, this is the gong show. And we, we won first and second place every week. We went there every week. Like, that's our allowance or something, you know? Right. Yeah. We either got the 500 or the 350. Okay. <laughs> but it's like two little high school dudes, and we was getting the, But one day, Mr. Mix was in there. And after we got through, he just ran straight up to it. Hey, man, y'all want to make a record? Right. I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Dev ain't, ain't really know him because he was from East New York. He's from New York, yeah. right. But I'm from Miami. I know this guy. That's that dude who, yeah, be doing that thing. But right. uh, he said, man, I ain't got my number. I'm going to go out of town this week. I'll be back next week. 
30 days we had that album done. Sure did. Two low life motherfuckers in 30, 30 days. days. He gave us 12 beats. 11 of them made the album. And only one, but it ain't make sense. That's the name of the song. I don't know why Luke I ain't like it. He was no. just like, they everything but that one. Mm. You, you know what my favorite album? Favorite record on the album is it's a funny record, Jerry Curl. Jerry Curl, right, right. <laughs> we was going at him then, though. They it's sampled like, the Beatles. Mr. He sampled the Beatles yeah, and shit. Yeah. That shit was no, no, dope. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. that yeah. Jerry Curl. That yeah. shit was dope, yo. Yeah. Like it was wow. some creative music on there, man. Definitely, definitely. So yeah, all that music coming home too. Y'all know after thirty years or something like that, y'all can get y'all music back. Y'all know this, right? Okay. Oh, the publishing and yeah, all that, right? Copyright. Yeah. Copyright. I just want to share that to anybody, any artist out there that's here. Right. So, so who yeah. got it now? Luke still got it. Um, it's currently at. Well, I don't know if I want to talk this part. I, I, it's on the way home. <laughs> it's, on the, it's, it's on the way home. home. It's in trust, right? They now. did the Wait right thing. Right, right, yeah, right, right, right. It's in trust. It's in trust. I feel it, you, it, all right, all right. They did the, they did the right thing. <laughs> How do you thing. feel when you look at Miami now? Like, do you feel like, yeah, that's good work? You know, I did my thing. I did. Right. You know well, I, I I feel like I did my thing. I feel like you know, it's still so much to do, but then so much has been done. Like mm -hmm. when you look over time, right? Because mm -hmm. um, you know, you got your Rosses and your Callis and your Tricks and your Trainers and you know Luke and all these other young dudes trying to come up. Like I got you know Iceberg Piccolo, my friend. They they like. Just bubbling, you know, just mm -hmm. waiting to break. But I, I still believe a house divided won't stand. I hope my Miami people are listening, mm -hmm. you know, because I watch you New York guys connect and collaborate and click clack and make it happen. Mm -hmm. I watch Atlanta niggas click clack clack, make it happen. But the Miami niggas be no. kind of standing off us a little bit. Mm -hmm. But you know, that's why Uncle Jay right here today, right. just to, mm -hmm. you know, they gonna feel me. I'm, I'm glad he brought that me. up because. I'm, I was always under the impression that the down south stuck together. At least that's yeah, that's yeah. the vibe well, I got. Well, well, you know what I mean? Down south, because we had to fight against all y'all from everywhere else. <laughs> right. I thought we were slow in country. Right. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Right. No, that's what it was back then. Well, Miami, I didn't think that, but the general population. Miami think, all right, we're a third world country in Miami. We we think we the capital of the state. We think we were our own <laughs> state. They like, no, you from Florida? Like, no, nigga, I'm from Miami. Miami. Right, right, right. I'm from Miami, not Dayton. Right. Yo, I right. saw somebody you know on on um, on my uh, IG, and she said Miami is not Florida. Right. That's what are they right. saying? It's not. It's not. That's, yeah. Right. Poison mentality, man. Right. <laughs> Back then, they used to call it the bottom, right? The bottom. The bottom. Man. Yeah. Man, everything. The, the bottom. bottom. Yeah. yeah, definitely. But yeah. I, Hey man, love is love though. You know what I'm saying? How the fighter won't stand, that's all I'm gonna tell you. you right. So so you trying to bring bring everybody together. Yeah, and that's what I was doing with this Mount Rush more, and that's kinda why I went back home, you know, just to move around. Cause, you know, I I got access, you know, to, mm -hmm. to our people, you know. Yeah. And yeah. um Yeah, you know. So, Sometimes brother need a hug, man. You yeah. go to say, man, you gonna get hit right there. Go over there. Right, right. right. Yeah. If I can advise anything, I got to give or help. You know, I'm gonna give it to you. I ain't gonna right. hold it back because it ain't gonna do me no good. Right, right. So let me do you some good. I want to throw some names at you, and you just tell me what they mean to you, or what it mean, or what did it mean to you at the time? Jam Pony Express. That's part of that JT money. <laughs> that's the me yeah, right. Ooh, nah. yeah. <laughs> That's that your money. That's right. That, yeah. Uncle Al. I got my brother. Same thing. Right. Like, it's the music. See, now those are the dudes who influenced the culture, like right. the the music they played, digging in the crate, pulling out them B sides of them instruments, right. and then they'll get on and jam. That's what right. made the music do that. Right. I, I would say, even though I'm from New York, that was the first time I heard a lot of DJs on the mic. Yeah. You didn't really like New York DJs wasn't on the mic like, like that, that right. like that. Down there, they, that's that was the culture. I used to go play. People were like, man, why you just keep talking on the record? Right. I say you on him. He rocking that mic, boy. Right. Listen, right. It was yeah, the he's mic. Trying to hear the song, and I'm like, no, he's rocking that song. Right. Right. You know, yeah, so I encourage anybody time. to go back and check out the old Jam Pony Express. <laughs> yeah. That them tapes was legendary. True story. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. Nah, I was I was thinking, you know, some of your records, I didn't even know they were your records because we would just play them in the party. Didn't I just say that? At the, at me? Oh, I told you that. Yeah. Right, nah. No, nah, I'm just saying. Like in 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 school, we would we had these dances, and you would just it, everybody would line up, and we would. I don't know if it's the centipede or what, but whatever. I don't even know what no. that was about. But we would be in a line. <laughs> we would go straight through the party, and everybody would just right. be doing the same thing to the sure, beat. Sure. And it was so fast that was you could really only do a really fast two step right, right, right. or you was you know oh, you, shaking yeah, or you was doing other things yeah, 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 yeah. 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 or or or, 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 or right 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 
<laughs> don't pop it. Players don't pop it. We throw the D. Nah, I switch. But look, though, right? I was just telling dude today, because we know we're working on this documentary, and I was trying to explain to him, like, my records have always been bigger than me. Like, they right. never know who made it. Like, right. man, like sometimes at Showtime, they be like, damn, you did that song too? Damn, you yeah. Did that? Right. Damn, you did it. That's like, wow. Yeah. Do your homework, man. It's, <laughs> no, it's, it's dope, though, but it's it's also like sometimes you can get overlooked like that. From, Pro from, from Right, like definitely. But it, it allows me to introduce myself mm. properly now. Right. Now yeah. that we are queen, and let me yeah. put you up on something. <laughs> right, yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I, I get two introductions almost. That's a fact. Right. I, I, was, I, was, I was always curious, like, because... Someone would say you was a womanizer. Yeah. You, cause, Oops, I mean bitch. I was a post on bitch right. and wise. Every, like, literally, every word was bitch, hold, da 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 How did that work out for you yeah. when you in, in in the industry in terms of trying to, you know, maneuver? Like, did you get a lot of flack, flack for that? They tried to, but they couldn't because the women loved it. Right, like, ironically. I, I, ironically. Talk about the, this. Right. Yeah, women say, God damn, Jay, you don't go off on us no more. <laughs> wow. Like, I'm getting soft. You know what I'm saying? But... I'm grown J baby now, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. I'm like, come here, girl, let me show you what to do with it, you know what right, I'm saying? Right, right. But anyway, though, but nah, right? right? But see, those records were strong on the album. Like, if you listen to Boys and Clan, you're only going to hear two of those songs on the album. The rest right. of the stuff was Street Get street, Money, street money mm -hmm. right. lyrics. But those B.I.s and O.A. Right. records, they were so strong, it seemed like, boy, the whole thing, all you did. Yeah. Now, I, I actually went back and rewind the tapes and looked at them like, yeah, people was true. But at the time, nobody was doing it that, that hard. raw, right. that effect. You know, yeah, like, right. damn, boy, you cold. You know, I had mm. uncles and shit like, damn, boy, that's you cousin like that? Yeah. Hey, man. This shit was straight to the point. He'd be like, think right, about it. Up. Get your shit straight before you become the bitch that I hate. Like, it was right, like straight okay, to the boom, point. Okay, boom, I got one for you. <laughs> All hiphop.com. Before you become the bitch that I hate. Um... This I dedicate to the girl that I hate. Coogee Rap. What was yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rap. Truly yours. Yeah, truly we yours. made before you become the bitch yeah. that I hate. Oh. Inspired inspiration. Inspired by. Yeah, Coogee inspired by. Wow. So you're right. So it, it makes sense. That's what you were listening to. You, you see what I'm saying? Oh, shit. Yeah. See how the truth yeah. work? Right. See, G-Rap going to love this. G-Rap going to love that, yeah. man. That's the truth. I could tell he was listening to something outside of where he right. was from because yeah. there was no way in the hell he was rhyming like that. Right. Without a... Yeah, see, that's that original I mean, game. That's why I be telling people, I'm like, boy, y'all ain't heard Gucci way back then. Right. Nah, he's just crazy. Yeah. 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 Now, when, when you hear those records Scooby now, what, what do you think about? Would you When you hear those records now, what do you think? See how much I still remember? Because I could rap a lot of that stuff when I hear, like, as soon as it started coming on, you start remembering getting back in your zone. Yeah. Right. And, uh, and inspiring. But, I mean, good music is good music, man. That's yeah. all I can say. I just remember I was on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. And I hear it. Like, the stuff I like then, I, I probably still like today. Like, those, you know, people make those fly by nights, the one here, on, you know, and we like that for whatever it was, but I never got caught up in that. I'm like, yeah, I can see what they're doing. I see where they went. Right. But mm -hmm. this, the, the stuff you can feel or relate to, mm -hmm. I think anybody can get with that or you it'll, it'll go with you, right. I believe. Yeah. You, you speak yeah. highly of legends. Is there anybody you would like to do a record with that you haven't gotten a chance with? Who would that be? You could, you could get on the record with anybody. Um, Who would that be? Uh, right now, I got to be Scarface. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. That never happened? I'm from nah, yeah. but listen, and we talk, you know what I'm saying? I call him, hey, just checking on you. Hey, he'll get me back. Yeah, brother, all love. you know. <laughs> I, I flew to uh, Houston on a retirement party. I said, boy, you can't quit. Just like this is. You can't quit. Yeah, right. Nah, but anyway, though, uh, I saw the record. He was, he was saying, man, Jay, the record five, I'm just tired. He, you know, he said, <laughs> yeah. hey, we going to do our thing, though. That's my brother. Don't he got a tour about. now, so he going right. to come to your city and, and y'all going to jump in. And he showed on the way, right? Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's just a matter of time, man. Yeah, right. You know? yeah. Now, your guy was talking to us about a tour you're putting together. With, um, yeah. You, I think, of Drag On, Mr. Cheeks, and people of that nature. Well, it's it's an idea it's right an idea. now. Okay, okay. Just to bring like, you know, underdogs on top, man. Everybody everybody been not done that, but then, you know, you know, wake up the sleepers, you know, I, I just wanna all right, they're gonna say the same thing every time, every week. Let's give mm -hmm. them something different. Right. You know, what about yeah. this other music that we like? Right. Right. You know, but it's it's an idea, it's in the works. Um yeah. Uh, what, what them people call investors? Yeah, no, nah, I'm just, <laughs> just, man, I'll be just talking to the world, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, when you, uh, you know, 
when you write now, when you make songs now, what what, what what's your process like? Are you still feeling it? Are you are you are you rushing, forcing, forcing it? Yeah. Not well. I'm still driven by the beats, you know. Um, mm -hmm. Sometimes my, my my pen just go on mm -hmm. its own, but and I listen, man. It's so crazy. I still got stuff that I haven't even recorded yet because I used to write so far ahead, right? Right. But then every time I get a new beat, I have to write something new. But now I just got this stuff. So when I go back yeah. and listen, it's like, oh shoot, boy. And that's how some of these records come. But I, the beat, the beat, take me where it want me to go. And then I, I try to be current on affairs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could talk about me all day, but I don't want to hear about you all day, man. Just give yeah. us something we can feel. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Give us some music. Yeah. Yeah. Got you. Right. But yeah, I ain't forcing it though. Cause boy, I got a secret album I ain't told nobody about, but it ain't rap. A secret? Oh, it ain't what kind rap. Of album? What kind of album? Say T Southern Funk Soul Bass. Ah. I'm talking about, see, I'm, see? I'm crawled the 50 line. I'm back again with the platinum chin. You understand right. me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I shout this, man. But you know, go ahead, nephew, do your thing. Uncle Jay love you, but. It's a next level. Next so you level. sing, sing a little bit, a little country, yeah. little country. Definitely not country. <laughs> funk then, funk, funk, little funk. Now funk. look, look, here I got something. So for you. bass. I got, I got something for you though. Mm. Scarface is on tour, and that's what he's doing. Like he's doing instruments. He's playing. Oh yeah, but he can do that. You know, yeah. face play for real. He play. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He get that. down. Yeah. Maybe y'all can tour together. That's yeah, dope. we can do anything. Anything we think of, man. That's what I want to say. And, and, and if you could think of it, man, you can, you know, manifest it and make it come. You know, you just yeah. got to do the work and, you know, go that way. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Crawling or pulling yourself. I don't care. Run. But you, you got to go that way, you know. Yeah. And that's, they, they go my life right there again. Mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Refuse to lose. Who that Chuck, Chuck D? Come on, man, let's go. If y'all oh, know, the, it was all hip hop. All hip -hop. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't only Cool G rap. It was other people too. It was other people, right. Yeah. right? Do you feel Miami still has a sound, so to speak? Because you know every region at, in, at, at that time had a sound. Right. You know what I mean, which they, they were known for booty right. shake at the time. They do have a sound. Uh, I think Miami trying to get away from it because right. they try because they are influenced by the majors Internet. pushing that same. Right sound like mm -hmm. you can't even tell where cats from these I, days that's my everything point sound like uh -huh. whatever it sounds like you know in my days how you, you feel know about that? Was come, I, I just think that's just the truth you know the watering down of our game you know because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. when you heard that Miami stuff you know that was man when we heard that east course mm -hmm. the break beats and them right. horns we knew when we heard that funk that do 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 and then listening to the stories, we was able to see it was like the news. We was able to see in everybody's yeah. world. Yeah. Right. Right yeah. now, you can't see nothing but the dope hole in the strip club. Mm. <laughs> That's right. all you're going to yeah. see. You ain't going to see nobody. Office, you ain't see no good times. Yeah, right. Yeah. That, that's true because yeah. that's how I learned what a brome was. Yeah, and, a, and, a, and yeah, the, the paint, the glaze, and the bowling ball yeah. paint, and yeah, you know, because he took us, he took me to his world. Right, you know what I mean, like that's what I knew what did. Miami was like by listening to what he was doing. Right, so he he wasn't he sounded exactly like where he was from, but he yeah. could spit. Right, yeah. right. You know what I mean, so I think that's what's missing a lot. What do you what do you think about um? Some of the politics about Miami now, like for example, they trying to stop kids from coming down. I'll be, I mean, yeah, free, they don't tore it up. Yeah, about? They don't tore it up. <laughs> uh, hey, they ain't never want us out there. I know, <laughs> but to, to to tell everybody is crazy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I saw that commercial too. Right. Don't come here. Right. We don't want you. But, and that's how bad it's got for them to be that straight right. up. Yeah, listen, man, something will. And I like I I don't even go there, but I heard. People coming down last week, man, it's, it's checkpoints in and out. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. Saying? It's yeah. checkpoints. And they're closing the road down, so it's one lane, so they make sure you, everybody got to go through this funnel. Wow. You know? yeah. It's $100 parking. Wow. Yeah. And up. But they try, they're just trying to discourage and deter. Right. But now, mm -hmm. maybe I can afford. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I was going to say, now, back in the day, uh, uh, it, was, it, was, it was definitely the destination. Miami, Daytona Beach was big. Right. Even you know, freak Nick is kind of in that same conversation. Right. Um, were y'all were y'all really extra, you know, doing well like back then? Like, did you did you do those things? Uh oh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I was there. You right. know what I'm saying? I helped push the, the narrative, the culture. Yeah. But um, I don't know why them people think they could put out a free knee documentary without JT money. I but was wondering. I don't I was know. Wondering. Like, like them other cats who talking was there. Ooh. We didn't even know them. Then. We didn't see them. Mm. They wasn't on the porch yet. Mm. But I was there. But I ain't see the star and nothing. I'm just, nah, nah, I'm here to let you know. Hey, look. It's nah, nah. Yeah, it it's is hip hop. Right. And, and it's all hip hop. All hip hop. And all I was. That, all I do is just make way for me to uh, add it in my JT Money documentary. You know what I'm saying? The yeah. true story. Because I got what it called receipts now. I got the tapes. You got, you the, got tapes? the tapes. Damn, you got the tapes. Man. I had to burn my, my freak dick tapes. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah. yeah. Man. yeah. <laughs> Ain't no way. <laughs> Ain't but no way. Nah, you say you had to burn it. Ain't no way people need to know I'm going to see this. No, sir. Yeah, well, you know, it's a concert, but I, I just wanted to put that out there. Yeah. Stir up a little song. Well, I'm going to holler at some folks <laughs> over there. So now, they, they need to make an edit. But yes, we did do that. That yeah. was a big uh, platform to jump off anything. Like, you got something new going, you mm -hmm. want to be at the Daytonas and the Freak Nick, mm -hmm. you know, with your posters and your flies and doing shows, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. If you're in this business now, if you just came to party and see them babies and punch your cars and do your thing, yeah. that was a great thing, too. But that was a part of the culture yeah. then. Like, that was so, really part of the culture. Like, I heard so, Yeah, and I heard so many different different music from the South. Right. Like, that's when I first yeah. heard Chop and Screw. That's too. when other people would get the music. When yeah. They came down for that. Bro, came down, take, it yeah. take it back. That's how take it back. Spread, yeah. Right. Yeah, right. yeah absolutely. It, it, yeah, that, it, was, it, that was the life. Right. At it, least that's how I felt. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right now, let's talk about your um, at the time your big hit, um, "Who That," mm -hmm. yeah. and then you also introduced the world to Soleil. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. How she? What's, what's what's going on with her, by the way? Uh, she married the professor. Yeah, girl. from married yeah. professor girl. Yeah. You know. Okay. Which is my guy. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and he was on uh, Luke's record. Yeah, yeah he was on Luke. Yeah. By the way, his his shit was dope too. Yeah. Pawns in the game. Yeah. yeah. Pawns in the game. Yeah. That yeah. was a dope ass album. Listen, it was Griff that made our album come out in 1990 instead of 89. Instead of 89? Because when he was uh, going through the controversy, Luke said, hey, man, y'all hold I got to do this right now. And he put out oh, Griff right wow. now. Oh, yeah. okay. So you said Two See, New Lives was done before, yeah. way before that? Yeah, when he came. Yeah, right. Griff had all that he controversy. Wow. He sat, right, he had he the sat. controversy. Wow. So you know, Luke on. was on that's that the, controversy. That's even more dope because that's yeah. the class. That's yeah. the, to this day, you listen to uh, the album, man. man. It's, it's timeless, yeah. man. Uh -huh. So, it's so you were saying. Oh, oh yeah, so, yeah, yeah. So you introduced the world of Soleil and you yeah. came out with this huge hit, man. Uh -huh. Did you find it difficult to, I guess, you know, they say a follow up, like to reach that level of success again in terms of a hit record, if you will? Or that was never your aim. You just I know that wasn't your aim because no, you just but, did music to do music. Right, and I, and I still do it to do it, but that just show you the, the power of, of, of the majors, you know, when they push that button. Because mm. if you listen to Who That, but, I mean, Who That is Who That. Who That is one of those records. Right. Mm -hmm. If you listen to him in the beginning, he say, about time. So I felt like about time they came and <laughs> yeah. gave me some money. Right, right, like, right. Y'all came and saw me. But anyway, um... You know, we followed up with Hollow. They was they was excited about it, but I think I got other records. Like, all right, on that same album, right? This song, Whole Problems Ain't No Problem. Whole problems, That's the right. reason I still work today. Mm. But the majors don't even know they got that record. Mm. Right. Hey, I'm probably gonna shoot a video for that myself too, cause yeah. listen, they this song. Yeah, some people probably never heard of Whole Problems and Run to Y'all. Like them, like and Kite to the Boys. Kite to the Boys, album. right? Them, them street records. They're like, boy, I know you're gonna do that song. You can't. Right. Like I can't do a show and not do these songs. Right. But the funny thing is, I could do that same show and not do that. Right. Mm. And they're not mad right. because they want to hear Kite the Boy run to y'all, whole problem, Chevy mm. game, come clean. Right. You know, right. And it's it's fine. But I call them the club shows when you go to the arenas and the stadiums and big field. You right. got to throw that who that that how low that shake with your mama gave. Yeah. yeah right. You know, club shake work anywhere. Yeah. You know, as soon as the ladies see that, yeah, boom, go doom, they right. drop it. <laughs> you, know, you know what else I like from Devin Ed? Uh, home, home, home team, team. Pick home team. Up, pick, pick it up, pick it up. Pick yes, it up. So. Da -da. Yeah, that was, see, see, that was see, see, see them them brothers. They, I'm talking about literal oh, that, mom and that, daddy. See, I didn't know same that. mama, same daddy. Right. Brothers, right? Yeah, Devin right. drugs. You know, yeah. That's crazy. You know, I was always confused by that because um, I was like, how does I, I, how, how someone from New York link up and do a record with you? But y'all were going at New York though. Yeah. Oh yeah, right. When, so that was confusing uh, to me. Like I, I, I didn't understand how, how that worked. Um. Well, it was just the culture. It was, it was the what you call it, the temperature of the game. Because right. again, y'all wasn't 
Luke selling means of records, but y'all wouldn't get that nigga no kind of. Right, exactly. Okay, boy, I see you down now. Right, right. Uh, it right. was just like, man, that boy said, we ain't messing with that. Right. That's yeah. how them niggas were. That's why Luke used to say what he say to Russell or Spike Lee or whoever right. else. At the like, time, right. Hey, boy, right. Nigga, yeah, nigga. But not for nothing, Luke was the first rapper up here to get get burned with um um I Wanna Rock. Yeah, that was that the was, first record, record in big. New York City. And then it was Master P. Then it was yeah. Outkast. Right. And you know right. who was breaking all them records? Kid Capri. Kid Capri. Kid Capri. Yeah. Shout out to Kid Capri. Shout out to Kid Capri. Kid Capri. Kid Capri. Well, too. Yeah. yeah. He was so. definitely introduced to South Records. Yeah. You know, and for the clubs, it was Big Cap. Big Cap Big was Cap. the only he, the first DJ in the clubs. He was doing it from the tunnel, playing Southern Records. Nobody was doing that before yeah. Big Cap. See, Nobody. He heard that music. See, that's right. what I used to tell people. Like, when they, back when they were saying the Southern Cats couldn't rap, I like... Just to take him off, take that <laughs> rapper off. Now, just listen to the music. Yeah. The music by itself is like, make you, you know what I'm saying, the music. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? I think the tribal jungle new shit. <laughs> right. I don't know. But with that bass, but then he just put some lyrics on it. Get rid of that rapper. Yeah. He not talking about nothing but the instrumental. And then here goes my thing now. Because we can get on these beats, but can you niggas get on these beats right. and flow again? Yeah. Can you rock this? Right. I right. can rock yours. Can you rock mine? Hey. Right. I'm just saying. That's all it is. Nah, you hey. definitely hey. Right. right. You Yo, it's, it's funny you say that, though, because, you know, Jay-Z caught a lot of flack for, you know, he was one of the earliest people to start uh, partnering up with people from down south. When he jumped on high with Juvenile. Yeah, yeah. High. Yeah. He had uh, Big Pimpin'. Big Pimpin', yeah. He had a, he had a few records. Yeah, though. well, he was the smart one. He had mm -hmm. the vision. He well, at that point, it couldn't be denied, man. It was, it couldn't was, be denied, it, yeah. It just couldn't be denied. Like you said, good music. Good, good music. music. Right. It just survive. couldn't be denied. Now, now, do you hold a grudge? Because I know, like, Willie D, we had Willie D in here. Willie D was, he was not, like, he was mad. He was, About what? Nah, he was just like, <laughs> you know, you know, basically New York, T.I. feels same T. I. vibe. T. T. Same T. vibe. You know, just feeling like you had to really fight, fight to get it, to get right. the... Respect. respect. But, but see, that was general. That was that was them generalizing the whole right. New York. Everybody in New York we, wasn't we, like that. Yes. I wasn't well, like that. We I weren't. See, I had that problem. And Jeezy too, by the right. way. Jeezy, me, I yo, didn't have that problem, man. You ain't had that problem. I did not have me, JT, money, Brendan, son. I ain't had that problem. Yeah. Uh, I, New York niggas fought with me, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, we was, was fighting bad. with them niggas and Jack the Rapper niggas. New York niggas took me in the elevator. Jay, come here. And stood around me like this. We going up there to loop them flow. That's when we dope. had the jail, it was New York niggas. Well, that's some Miami dope. niggas, some New York niggas. Yeah, that's but, what's up. But again, um, I, that's a general thing. I understand the culture. I understand what y'all heard and didn't hear. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I knew what you wanted to hear. And I was <laughs> doing mm -hmm. my thing. Right. Yeah. But, yeah, that was somebody trying to generalize the, the whole thing. The irony of it is, and I'm going to say it because I'm from here, you got New York niggas now trying to sound Somebody like the down south. That's, that's, that's the me. irony of all that right. shit. That's it's beyond crazy. ironic. It's funny, though. It's beyond funny ironic, now. But that's the radio's fault. Yeah, yeah, but I ain't mad, though. I, I figure that's part of the growth. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We, go, we go through it, grow through it, and whatever, you know? Mm -hmm. It's a story to tell. It's just something to talk about. Dun, 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 dun. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. What was that? Biggie, you got a story to tell. Oh. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Come on, man. You all hip hop. Come on. He always nah, ran. Nah, he always ran. <laughs> <right. laughs> nah, you, you, you Maybe doing, my tone was off. But you're doing like my man Ari Melber used to do. He'll drop a lyric, a bar, or something <laughs> mad, mad obscure right in the middle of a telecast, and you're supposed to just pick up the pick end it of up, it. Right? <laughs> yeah. We wow, my bad. Yeah, yeah, no, this it's all good. So, how do you, you know, overall, fifty years of hip hop, we're here. Uh, talk about the state of things right now, like how you feel about it, like not just Miami, not just the just South, hip -hop everything. Itself. Do you listen to it? Do you like it? What do you want to see different? Like, um, all right, I still love her. I tried to get mad at her, but I can't get mad at her. Yeah, you know, she, she that bad. Yeah. Uh, these brothers and sisters definitely eating mm -hmm. yep. way more than, you know. Yeah. Um, it's the biggest thing in the world. Um, but it's, it's the control, you know what I'm saying? Some kind of way, mm -hmm. we just got to control our fate and destiny. But, mm -hmm. I mean, it's a money game, it's numbers, and the people who, all right, think of when we were selling 
records and stuff. You could sell your records and make money. Okay, we're going to cut that out. We're going to mm. do digital. Mm. Then, you know what I'm saying? Now we're going to buy up a... a but then the independent still could go to a radio station. You could break in a regional market, mm -hmm. then it hopefully it spread. They brought up every station in the country that mean anything to any s civilization. Yeah. yeah. And they tell them, nigga, these the eight songs y'all gonna play. Right. Mm -hmm. There's no more mix shows. Ain't no going out there. Yeah, you know, you got a man, and you got niggas falling out what they do because he got a job, but he got a playlist. But like, well, damn, you can't, oh, you acting funny now, you can't, yeah. and I get it, you know, I'm, I respect your business, but nigga, you can't slip in there, slip it in, man. Yeah, but yeah. get mad at him, he got a job to do, he got to right. feed his family too, man, you yeah. know, you know, he'll spin it at the club if he got a club, nigga don't owe you nothing either, nigga, right, right. Niggas, niggas be entitled to, you rap niggas entitled. Mm. Right. There was yeah. a dope station in Miami called Rhythm 98. Remember that? Yeah, I remember Rhythm yeah, 98. That shit was dope. They used to play some dope. Yeah, I still got tapes from it, that it's shit. It's just stuff yeah. like that, so we can't yeah. control it, though. All right, right. We can't control or influence what we want to influence because they influence it. Like, they don't care. They're not even listening to our records. <laughs> it's yeah. just like, this my shit. This the next one today. I mean, this the next one. This what they, That's going to be a hit tomorrow. And they just push that button and do it. Yeah. Now they force it on you, man. Yeah, yeah. But you know, cats, them young cats still going underground because they they got a lot of big artists that I ain't never even heard of mm -hmm. selling out arenas. Like, well, who the hell is this? Yeah. <laughs> this nigga here, and he rocking too though. Yeah. I ain't right. never heard this. Yeah, right. Yeah. That's crazy. So he, 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 right. That's part of her. See, she that bad. Right. Yeah. Well, that's you know, the right. internet did that. You know, yeah, what I mean? right. and like you said, it leveled the playing field. It leveled the playing field, it, it, it play and, feel, and it made everybody sound like each other too. That's a, yeah, that's the gift, the gift and the curse. Yeah. You know where no, you right. don't know where nobody's from no more yeah. because of the internet. And then you gotta all right with the internet thing. You gotta learn how to work it now. The algorithm, uh, right? It's, to, like <laughs> it's another job. So yeah, like I'm. I'm Thank y'all for having me right here. This is me getting to the world, right? Yeah. I can't do this all day. <laughs> yeah. I, that's not me. Right, I'm right. I'm not walking around like this yeah. and arguing with me. <laughs> that's not me. I yeah. just don't do that. Right, right. You know what I'm right. So, mm -hmm. what's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? Right, right. Yeah, man. Yeah, right. no, I hate you. Are we going to get ever another Poison Clan project? Matter of fact, you are. As soon as oh, Immortal drops. I got the project. It's Immortal, right? Okay. I, I, I got... You know, again, the, the trick that it, Rick Ross single. I got one, me and CeeLo Green, me and Eight so Ball and MJG, mm -hmm. uh, me and the full entire Poison Clan, mm -hmm. Drugs Man, Uzi, Uzi myself, right. yeah. And um, we got about, we got seven songs in the can. I'm going to put the first single on the Poison Clan on my solo album. Okay. And then the Poison Clan following. Uh, and okay, I can't wait everybody for that, back, you know. That's the yeah, we're starting it. to do shows down in Miami, you know. Right. And places. Yeah, we rocking too. Okay. That's what's up. Honk them back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> As you should know, be, man. Honk them. No, right, right, right. As you yeah. should be. Thank you, brother. Thank you, brother. Exactly. Thank you. Word. Poison. Yo, um, how are you and Luke still cool, y'all? Yeah. Yo, very cool. Yeah, good, man, good. Mr. Campbell, cool. Yeah, that's what's up. Uh, yeah, that's what's up. I I got a little upset with Luke though. I ain't gonna lie. He, <laughs> he compared Freak Nick to uh, the March on Selma and and the Million Man March, and I was like, Luke. He compared it to that. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> what he wow. Did? How he did that? I want to hear this one. <laughs> well, he said it's Black History, which I guess it is, but he was saying this. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he reaching. He pulled the muscle with that reach. I was he like, reaching, yo. Look, man, I'm laughing and sad, right? But then me knowing Captain Dick, he probably did on purpose. Just he so might have. Could do, that. do that. He right? might have did that to, that to, sell, to sell some, uh, well, not DVDs, but, you know, some screens. Yeah. Talking content. It's a controversy. Yeah, good, bad, ugly. Talk about it. Talk yeah. about him, yeah. yeah. About, Free yeah. commercial. We the definitely man came up on controversy. Yeah, that he yeah. did. Yes, he did. Yes, he yeah. did. And in the USA. Yeah. He is a yeah. legend in that regard. Right. Free speech legend, yeah. for sure. He's black history that way. You can say what you want on records because of Luke. Me, Look, this is... Uh, um, I hate hoes like the I have a dream speech. I, have a dream speech. <laughs> <laughs> I hate hoes. Hoes ain't me. Yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. I marry one. <laughs> right. Yo, you know he's the first one to reference that. Life's a bitch. Oh, yeah? So, uh, uh, yeah. Listen. Okay. Go back and listen. 
Okay. I'm glad he said that. That's what I tell he him, dude. It. I said, yeah. check the dates, man. Check the dates. Like, I, I can't be arguing with kids. He started like, the record off. Go check the dates. Life's a bitch, so I marry one. A nigga in love with a bitch is very oh, dumb. The PC is whole oh, haters. Oh, is the main oh, reason why all oh, hoes oh, haters. Oh, but I don't oh, give a oh, fuck. Oh, oh, yeah, that boy was yeah. cold back then. Come on. That boy was that cold. Was, that was 18, 19. Yo, I know them shits was ringing, yo. Right, right. I'm from New York, bro. I listen to everything. I used to listen to everything. That's what you got. See, that was me. I from Miami. Everything. everything, everything, yeah, from that's everywhere. Right. I just wanted to hear it. Yeah, that's right. right. Me too, though. Feel I mean, like you get to that right. point. Yeah, though. no, I feel you. But I will say, I listened to to, to you mostly in college in the parties. That's right. what I will admit. Yeah, you was you was uh, grown enough to handle it. Yeah, right. Yeah. Exactly. If I'd have got you young, right. boy. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Nah, exactly. No, that's a, no, that's a fact. That's a fact. Yeah, man. Well, let me let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. There's a stereotype about Miami, right? Okay. And you, you, you originally came out, sort of, you know, came up in the '80s. Right. What, what was, what was Miami like in the '80s? Because all I saw was like Miami Vice, Scarface. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we knew about Luke. I knew about Luke mm -hmm. and Two Live Crew. So even before, uh, even before all the controversy, they used to rap too. You know right. what I'm saying? <laughs> Um, but what was the, what was the, uh, what was the life like? Was it like those things, or was it, or was that just? Um, I, I guess somewhere well, I, I would have been too young, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, all I knew was so I, on the block. You know, I, I knew once it got to our part of the time. See, right, they right. show Scarface now, but they ain't show where Scarface had to get it off at. Right, right, he right. He gave it to his man who had to come to my man. Right. Yeah. Hey, it ain't, you know, they were trying yeah. to write us out the story. Yeah, you know exactly. Y'all ain't seen us in the story till New Jersey City came right. out. Yeah, that's right. That's when But then they, now they, they separate that's us true. from them. That's true. You know, because, yeah, yeah. hey, man, they had to. That's a fact. They, you couldn't come across there without coming in. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah right. but let those with ears hear. We right. ain't said nothing. <laughs> I'm just thinking about all the legendary Miami artists. Like, remember MCADE? AD Gigolo yeah. Tony. That's my man right there. Antoinette. Tony. Anquiet. Anquiet, sorry. The one love. The one that's my little brother. Boy, that's in this Come on, man. Beat Master Clay D. Clay, that's my dog. He yo, yo I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Miami <laughs> to you is Houston to me. Yeah. I'm yeah. telling you. Right. Yeah. I, I got family in Florida. Yeah. yeah. So okay. I I okay. know that I right. I was there. I know got that. You. Yeah, right. I know okay. this stuff. You okay. know what I mean? Got you. I know this See, stuff. We went to Miami. This way bro's gonna learn it, because I'm gonna say y'all go look at this episode, yeah. man. Yo. <laughs> I gotta give thorough credit on this one, yo. Yeah. yeah. Word. So yeah, Miami man, definitely can thorough, man. Yeah, thorough. No, that's, that's why he's sitting thorough, in the right? chair. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's so okay. they definitely contributed to hip hop, man. No, I, no, I believe definitely, it. yo. Yeah. So of, I'm, and I'm missing so many. Just that's just off the top of my head. Like yeah. so, 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 okay, so, 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 so. Like right. But when you say Jigolo, like Jigolo, Tony and Shady, them, <laughs> them was the rappers for us back then. Right, MC Shady, MC Shady. I used to like MC Shady. Them was the closest ones to halfway good. I'm just saying it was. Them was the ones. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Shady was dope. Them we gotta get him. We gotta get Shady on the platform. Yeah, he yeah. Really, he's in Atlanta now. Yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, he yeah. was on Luke Records too. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah, definitely. But yeah. Where was he from? Who? Shady. He's, he's from originally up, yeah. from. He's That's what I was saying. Because when you look yeah. at how he dressed, yeah, he originally from yeah. the Bronx. Yeah, okay. He moved, um, moved Atlanta. 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 Yeah. Sounds like man, he sure dressed New York, man. Yeah, he he was from New York, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, even, even. I mean, listen. Y'all had the influence. That was, that's what made y'all niggas crazy. <laughs> <laughs> right. Like, nigga, I was yeah. first. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Smash it, nigga. Smash Everybody from New York got a cousin and somebody down south. Because everybody yeah. can't. We all come from down Bushwick south. Bushwick Bill. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody comes from down south. So yeah, that's why. Yeah. No, that's a fact. And the person up here don't got somebody from down south in their family. Yeah. And yeah. vice versa. Right. Mm -hmm. you know I mean, because we all, that's where we come from. Shoot, the first time I got on a plane, I flew to Florida. Right. The first time, yeah. Because my uncle lived down there. Yeah. Miami, yo. Yeah, man. Word. Yeah. What part of, this is what I don't know. What part of Miami you was from? Was it Opelika? I went to Opelika Elementary. I went to Ben Franklin over town. Okay. I oh. went to Ben Franklin in North Miami. <laughs> I went to New Orleans and Norwood. Okay. So, you know, my, my family ended up in uh, Miami Gardens. It right. used to be New Orleans. That's where we're right. at now. But Liberty City, Kansas City, over town, Opelika. I'm, I'm going to tell you how involved I was because just knowing. Convertible Burt. Yeah, big old Burt. Booby Boys. Booby Boys. Yeah. Miami Boy, he's a Miami dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he is. No, he really yeah. is. Yeah. He's a Miami dude. Yeah, he's a big old Miami dude. 
Yeah, so I'm, I'm telling you, I was connected with that shit. I, I, I knew it. Like, yeah, yeah. Because, again, I used to go and li- I used to go to the record store. I didn't even know who these people were. I'm just right. buying everything. Yeah, right. And I'm just going to listen to it. Yeah. And that's how I discovered that shit. Got you. You know what I mean? Bird had Mike Tyson out on 15th Avenue, man. Right. Mike used to have a convertible bird. Who did? Convertible bird had oh. Mike Tyson wow. on 15th Avenue. You know what I'm Talk saying? about, tell us about that. Just a great day to hood. Yeah. Could love him. Yeah, Mike and came Mike, out. Yeah, you know, Mike Street nigga anyway. Mike yeah. ain't worried about nothing. Right. Yeah. But C- Convertible you know, Burt would be is our I would say with, with up here to us is Alpo Rich Porter. Okay. Yeah, oh, oh, okay, um, got you. That's yeah. what so you ain't tell me you right. didn't say that. That's who no, convertible but, yeah. yeah. Nah, that's what, but, right, that's who convertible bird is down there. Got you. Got he's it. The, he's the. He's you know the. I mean? Yeah. Yeah. He's the. Yeah. He's a good dude, man. Got it. When y'all gonna get rid of uh, DeSantis, man? <laughs> <laughs> that came from love. I, I just want to know. Right yeah, I don't know, man. I'm still watching the movie, man. But uh, <laughs> they all having meetings about him. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'll be one even better. When, it, when, we, when we gonna get rid of George Zimmerman? Man, oh. Shit. Yeah, wow. When? So, uh, yeah. All on camera. Wow. <laughs> wow. All right, all right, all right. All, right. all on camera with it. Hey, we got work to do. We ain't promoting, hey. no, we ain't promoting that, but you know right. what I'm saying? We ain't promoting that, but I mean, we kill each other. I'm, I'm, saying, saying, I'm right. just saying. Yeah, yeah. well, he in Florida. Kill each other. Can we kill another? <laughs> I remember. I'm just saying. You know what I mean? DMX was willing to fight him. He ain't gonna do that. He wasn't gonna do that. I mean, no, he wasn't. He ain't about that life. DMX was. I know DMX, but he ain't about that life. No, he ain't about that. He ain't about that life. Yeah, definitely. It's crazy. It is what it is. That would have been him getting caught out though. Right. The fight was debate. The fight was debate. Exactly. Yeah. That was debate. Right. Exactly. 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 Got him. Got, got it. it, got it. All right, anything else you got popping? Yeah, um, just the album, man. I want y'all to know the album. I'm still out here doing this show. Okay. Yeah. I ain't been in New York in about ten years man, before the day. You shouldn't let me. You shouldn't let me um stay away so long. <laughs> yeah, man. Somebody, you know, but um, Dude. and we out here, man. You know, again, back again with the platinum chin. Mm-hmm. You know, like it's not great as platinum. Right. 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 Don't touch it. But, uh, yeah. but that's it, man. Music, you know, still love them. Wait, are these fronts or grills? They can't come out. They, that's permanent, man. He's from yeah. Miami, man. I'm just that's asking. permanent. Right. That's, that's permanent. They can't. Shorty, but, yeah. That's you know, permanent. Everybody rocking white tea. Now I'm doing, I'm waiting to go to Hollywood. I'm going to Hollywood. <laughs> I, gotta, I know they got something for me. Right. You right. Know, like me in Hollywood. Definitely not. Definitely not. Yo. I keep looking at that camera like, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. the nigga thought, what did you say about my mama? <laughs> 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 no, nah, we just having yeah. fun, man. Y'all enjoy yourself. Man. All right, man. Don't make it the last time, bro. Yeah, man. I appreciate yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, brother. All right. Brother, All right. thank you.